Instagram. Dolly all the way from Nigeria. Nigeria. She also lives in Holland. And then we have Dunique all the way from St. Martin. Represent. Well, <laughs> as you can see, I'm rocking the poofy look this time. Well, you didn't see the last time, but okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm actually in the process of transitioning my hair from straight to natural. And it's not an easy process. It takes yeah. a lot of patience. Mm -hmm. So I'm wondering if I should just go directly for the big chop or just slowly transition from straight to my natural hair. What do you think? Yes. What do you think? Yeah. Well, I have a big huge fro and I transitioned for a few months, maybe about two months. Then I cut off all the, it was a big huge chop, all the long, retouched, relaxed hair. And it felt so good, like I felt free. And now, yeah, here it is. I'm starting to get bored and I don't know what next to do. Maybe you can give me some suggestions? <laughs> yep. Can you tell her what to do? We thought about having some braids for yeah, a break. Yeah, get some extensions. And yeah, just a bit I have no summer. idea. <laughs> just a break, you know, like resting. And then if you have any ideas about what she should do with her gorgeous, big, yeah, looking natural fro. natural hairstyles. I, I could have use tried, them I too, actually, for when I do make the chop. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> or if I make the chop. <laughs> I have tried looking at YouTube videos, but it's really difficult to replicate. Like, I don't know, maybe it's the texture of my hair that is different from the videos I watch. <laughs> Perhaps the guys have really good channels you could yeah, you suggest. Give some suggestions. Mm -hmm. Hello Marie, tell, tell us, us about, about your, your hair. hair. Well, as you can see, um, this is not really my hair. I don't really? think you really believe that, right? Okay. I thought it's, it was. It looks so real. <laughs> yes. <sure. laughs> it's I right now. I'm wearing what they call. A, I would call it a mini fold, a break in between protective styling. I don't know. I don't know. My hair is just underneath braided, and then I just put a wig cap and a wig. Mm -hmm. So and then I have this. So maybe I could do that. Yeah, you can do that also. If you just buy a wig, you know, when you don't have time to style your hair and you really uh, like tired, you just do this. And uh, yeah, it's a lace wig. So I bought this little thingy, I don't know what it's called, I don't know. Um, strik, in Dutch you say strik. <laughs> and I bought this. Stripe, yes. I think you call it a ribbon. <laughs> a oh yeah, lace. okay, lace. a lace, a ribbon, yeah, whatever. Lace. Just to cover the line of the wig, you know? Okay. So that's about it, that's what I'm rocking today. Uh-huh. And then it looks good. A. You kind of have this Indian Rock. vibe going on. Rock. <laughs> I can't do that with my skirt. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so what else? You can try that. So I have these pants on. I really don't know what they call it. Really, I don't know. It's like this wide, fluffy, going with the wind, go with the wind. And I have this belt, it's brown. I try matching it with my shoes. My shoes are really old. Please don't look at <laughs> oh, Shut up. My shoes are really um, old. And this big um, necklace, I got it from. Where did I get it from? I think it's from H&M, yeah. And then, and then I just pair this with a white t-shirt and yeah, just trying to have something. I hope you guys like the combination. If you have any idea how I could change it, just let me know. Yeah. Okay. Um, so this is just a nice yellow bright t-shirt. I like bright colors with a polka dot skirt, red belt, really simple. Um, and some cool heels. My toes are not great, so maybe don't look at my toes. <laughs> yeah, but that's it. It's just a simple look with a nice fro to get some attention. Yeah. Check it out. <laughs> Hello, I'm Danique. And as you can see, I'm rocking the big poofy curly hair now. I'm really liking it. And I have these earrings I got from my boyfriend, actually. They're all the way from Chile. Handmade. Very beautiful. And here I've got this 
bracelet handmade in Africa as well actually I got it from my roommate very lovely person and let's go to the outfit oh first also my chain also made in Chile beautiful stone uh, it's a purple and doesn't match well with much but I felt like being daring today so I put it on anyways even if it doesn't who cares it's made with love <laughs> okay so here I have just a nice um, over the neck pink or I guess you call it fuchsia shirt um, with this uh, skirt uh, but it's an H&M I love pencil skirts especially with my figure I have this huge butt and then you have this low waist and it's hard to find good outfits to fit that figure so I'm really happy with this and then we have these blue shoes I actually got on sale on Facebook <laughs> my little secret shoe um, very comfortable and it looks high but there's also this huge platform on the bottom so it's quite comfortable and that was my outfit for today fashion advisor Fashion advisor, reveal yourself. Yeah, look at this beauty. Yeah. Schöne Farben, Blumen, Blumenwiesen, Punkte, rote Fußnägel, blaue Fingernägel. Hier rosa, hast du die Fingernägel kurz? Oha, rosa und gar nichts. Man sieht, da ist nicht. Das ist anders als bei den Deutschen. Die machen ja dann rote Fußnägel und rote Fingernägel. Und hier ist immer anders. Ja? Und das sind so auch die kleinen Details, die dann so einem Modedesign natürlich auffallen, weil das ist ja so, dass so ein bisschen mehr das hinter den Kulissen ist. Ne? Muss ja eigentlich in die Kamera gucken. Ne? Ja, super. Oh ja. Also Applaus für die Damen, ne? für die Mädels.